Great pace for much of that race, but it seemed those two pit stops really didn't make your life very easy, did they? No, today we, we had a bit of bad luck there in the pit stops because we definitely had a couple of slow ones. Particularly the first one was uh, costly because I think we would have just got George with an overcut, uh, which would have put me leader of the race at the time, which was a bit of a shame. But uh, yeah, it's, it's how it goes today. Honestly, the pace wasn't great either. I think the, I was struggling a lot with the front tires. The balance was nothing close to where it was on on um, on Friday. I couldn't push on the tires, and and in the end, 70 laps. I think we ended up where more or less where we deserved to be because uh, we just didn't have the pace we had on Friday. Were you surprised? I know it was a diff more difficult day yesterday versus Friday, but were you surprised at how difficult the tires were today? Yes, uh, clearly the, these temperatures, these conditions didn't go in our favor because we went from clearly dominating Friday on pace and on, on everything, on degradation, we had barely any deg, to all of a sudden struggling a lot with, uh, with, um, with the front tires and not being able to push, opening up the fronts. You just need to compare the last thing on soft, Lewis versus me, no? It's, it was a pretty big uh, pace delta, which this pace delta was in our favor. You've been consistent all year, so I suppose it must be quite nice to finish the first half of the season with yet more points. Yeah, yeah, but not not completely that satisfied with that race. I think we had, unfortunately, more pace than that. And probably the strategy we chose was was not necessarily the the best one overall in the race. I think all we, all the calls were were not really the perfect ones. I would say, like we usually do. So, um, you know, it probably would have been another story. You know, uh, but um, you know, together as a team, we learn, we improve, um, and that's going to be a useful one for for the future. Um, but yeah, it's good to, to score points with both cars and you know keep uh, keep track with, with McLaren, which is the important one. Um, but yeah, we didn't manage to get them today, so you know, we need to push harder at the summer break. There is the consistency there for you and for the team at the moment. What do you need to do to make that next step? Do you think after the summer break? Yeah, well, we need to um, you know do everything perfect. You know, we need to leave nothing on the table, and I feel today we've done a little bit. So you know, yesterday we maximized the potential, which was really good. So. You know, we did 50% of the job, I think. I think I don't look like a tricky afternoon out there. Some frustrations kind of feeling trapped behind your teammate. Just talk me through it. Yeah, well, no, no frustration. I mean, I was just following whatever distraction the team was giving to me and uh, fall a little bit behind and try to breathe with the tyres. We wanted to make one stop work. So we, we wanted to save the tyres a little bit. And, uh, and yeah, at the end, we, we managed. Uh, all in all, I think the result, especially compared to McLaren, that we equal points, I think it was a good afternoon. But obviously we started fifth and sixth and we were having you know some expectations to have a nice result today but uh, yeah we we were not quick enough during the race i think the hard tire was struggling to switch on the tire as well so yeah it was a, it was a tricky balance today in the car the consistency seemed to improve of late like in terms of results and the upgrades are working and stuff does that bode well for the second half of the year and what do you need to do to make that that step up really yeah i think it was uh it was quite a good month for us the last four races we we introduced a lot of new parts in the car they all uh, made us um, a little bit more competitive and uh, i think we just need to keep scoring points with both cars you know like today and uh, hopefully that's uh, our strength compared to mclaren for the construction. good fight back to start with it looked like you were having a fun race and were you just a bit disappointed that the pace kind of wasn't there towards the end yeah i think uh, in the middle of the race we were we were looking good uh, we were thinking to go for the one stop, so therefore I think we we didn't quite ma maximize that that stint, and unfortunately, yeah, that didn't work out as as good as we would liked. And then at the end, I mean, I just lost out by a couple of seconds on on Carlos and George. Um, we were much faster together with with Charles from behind, but unfortunately, there, there was virtual safety car for for a bit too long, and uh, yeah, that did hurt us a bit. Now, look, when you look back on this first half of the year, how are you feeling heading into the summer break? Um, a bit up and down, you know, a couple of reliability issues. But uh, other than that, I think uh, there are some positives to take from this first part of the season. But I certainly believe that uh, we've lost a bit our track in the last couple of races, so it will be very important to come back very strong for the triple header.